do you prefer light mode or dark mode when writing your piece of code in stm 32 cubyte DE? Today in this quick video, we are going to learn how to switch our IDE to dark mode and fix some problems related to it. So without any further ado, let's jump on in. Alright, so in order to switch stm 32 cubyte to dark mode and to access that, let's go from the window, preferences and then from the general menu, we access appearance and from here you can switch to the theme that you want Personally, I like dark mode, so let's choose it and see how it looks like and to apply the changes, we need to reset our cube IDE so let's apply some magic and yeah, here we are again there's actually one problem in this theme and it happens when you highlight some variable as you can see the highlight color is quite bad and the variable that you are highlighting becomes not readable so we need to fix that thing so let's head back to preferences again and in the search bar let's write annotations so in order to fix this problem there are actually two solutions we can either change the highlight color to make it dark so the variable can appear when it's highlighted or we can change the highlighting style and choose for example box for me this suits me better so I'm going to go with this solution and let's see how it looks see these variables are now highlighted and I can see what the variable is another problem I found in this theme is the inactive code highlighting let me show you so here in the main header we see how this portion of the code is highlighted and it's not readable in this case so let's fix this we are going to head back again to preferences and in the search bar we are going to write inactive and here we can see the option that we need to modify so there is no box style uh, highlighting I can choose that so I'm going to choose some darker color like this one for example um, well I didn't like it so I'm going to head back again and you know I think that this one would be better let's see how it looks like this one is also not good not this one You know what, let's choose some customized color like this one. Yeah, I mean, yeah, this looks more professional right now and it's readable. Awesome. And yeah, uh, from now on, I'm going to go with this dark style. So I like it. Let me know what you think. Do you prefer dark theme or light colored theme? All right, this was a short tutorial. This brings me to the end of this video. Stay tuned and bye bye.